Welcome back to the van build. Hear my voice? Here, let's go over here. Quick story. I was never gonna work on this truck uh, between October and December. It's when my work is the busiest, okay? Around Christmas time, there was a death in the family. I've had a roof leak. But I mark some time out in January so I can return to this. And when that day came, <clears throat> I woke up diseased. I'm not sick, I just have sinus, and I was tired. But it's time to return. Here's what's happening. The third video, fourth video of this series was that I made a mistake. I have made a miscalculation, um, an underestimate. <laughs> this is gonna mess me up. I've laid in bed, this has bothered me, <laughs> right? I do not want a hillbilly truck. Yeah. There's something very inspiring about tearing something apart because then you're forced to have to put it back together. So since we last left off, the battery that ran the lights is dead. The water heater, the electric, everything runs through this wall in order for it to connect to the solar power unit this wall you get it this wall so i made a decision let's take it down Whoa. the good thing about demolition is you don't have to hear my voice Schedule. I'm gonna prime, prep, paint okay. all of this. All right. Okay. Oh. Um, all right. Primer. A better paint than that. Oh, this is good. Okay. So I got primer. I got paint. All right. Sure. Nine foot by 12. Yeah, a plastic, what is it, drop cloth. And some tape. You know, one of my New Year's organization things is I came in this room and I uh, put everything, I, I not only put everything back, I, I made it better and I organized and I cleaned. Yeah, it's kind of a joy to come in this room and to find things. <laughs> in here all summer when it was 135 degrees. It's absolutely delightful in here now. You know, I watched the very first video of this or second. And it was funny because I stated my original plan. I didn't want to buy this last summer. My goal was to buy it in December to begin working on it in January. What I want to do is sometime in December, find a 10 foot box truck and then work on it to restore it as an RV, right? Yeah, January, February, March. One could argue I'm ahead. inside my head all right so I bought this in June July I would say around July I started begin be, I began looking for used trailer storage teardrop any type of uh, legitimate trailer door used 
Yeah. Can't, I, I can't necessarily find the one I want. And yeah, yeah. I even went the route of China. The shipping is uh, kind of high. But the next build is specific for the door. This one. Are you kidding me? What? Crack. It says crack. No. With frame, with locks, keys, white. 140 with um, $113 shipping. Oof. So if they take my offer with the taxi, the tax and the shipping, it's still $243. Two weeks later. There, there's an important measurement with this that I need to know, and that's the thickness. Oh. Okay. Let's go to Home Depot and get some supplies. I haven't driven this before Greece, September. You have never seen my roof with all light exposure because there's the, the back on it. Look how good it looks. All right, come on, let's, look, let's take a ride. Oh, we, can, we can go through that door. Whee! Okay. Wow, I haven't driven this in so long. Does it start? I know it does. I started up earlier. Can I explain something? This needed to start to be able to get the supplies so I can have the supplies to be able to work. Get a van for 19, I can get a box truck for $29. He says he has a pickup truck. I think that's even cheaper, 15. $15 for one hour. These are $99 each. Back here is $267. This here, add another 20. The screw is a $300 day. Three, $300 day. Exactly 
I need to know exactly where the door fits, and this is the best way I can do it, because once I have it dry fitted into this, I can build the frame around it in here. There is a method. It looks so good. The other thing looked like a craft project. A hillbilly truck, I tell ya. This is good. I also have to think about the support of the air unit, and even though the air unit in it isn't now, the structural part is. So I'm gonna end this vlog. I feel like this is a good, I think this is a good launching point. Are we back? Are we back? The best part of messing up is auto course correcting. Feels good. Don't worry about getting it started later. I'm back.